Though Webster was named most outstanding player, she wasn't the only Texas player honored. Hannah Allison, Haley Eckerman, and Shadara McNeil were also named to the all-tournament team. Texas posted a 360 hitting percentage over the two final matches that set a new championship record. Well, Texas had been knocking and knocking and knocking on that championship door. They kicked it in. Coach, you know, there's been a lot of talk about the volleyball world. This is a very athletic, very physical team. Do you feel like you proved to the rest of the country that you're also gritty and you also can do the passing and defense, the other elements to volleyball? Yeah, you know, the, people always describe us as athletic, but they never give us credit for what we can do in terms of the skills of the game. And mm -hmm. this team improved so much over the year. You know, we won all the serve and pass battles, which is critical in the NCAA tournament. Um, and they, they just team just grew, and it was so nice to see. Looking back on it, the experience you've had in Final Fours or just in big matches, how much did it help this team to win it this year? Well, it helps because they're always looking to me uh, in terms of confidence and being relaxed and that. And I'm, I'm just so relaxed being in that situation now that, it, you know, I was able to take a nap on game day and uh, <laughs> do the things. You got I a nap in? Yeah. So. Uh, they, they were just relaxed, and I, and I kind of left them alone. It was kind of like they were pitching a no-hitter. I, I just felt like there was a good environment about them, uh, the way that they were going through practices and their, their emotions. And right before the final, after the last practice before the finals, I just said, I'm handing over the keys, and time for yourself to drive to the national championship. So they did that. Oh, so you get a nappy and a natty. What was your message before you took the – I mean, you obviously said you were a little hands-off, but I know you said something to the team. What, what was the message? I, I tried to keep it the same routine. Just talked about competing and living in that moment for each point. And, uh, you know, things will take care of ourselves and, and be really good. at. We don't have to be great. We just have to find ways to win and, and stay within our routines and um, enjoy the moment. This is something you're never going to forget for the next 20 years of your life or ever. And uh, just go about it and let's represent Texas. You only have one senior on this team, Shadara McNeil. Now, a lot of people are going to say, well, you only lose one senior. A very important senior. Talk about what she meant to this team. Yeah, Shadira, the most underrated player in the country. Uh, she was the glue to our team. And, you know, I felt like she got robbed not being an All-American. But, you know, she was the one that was kind of the driving force behind this team. She was our passer, played six rotation, um, could do so many things in terms of spreading out our offense and keeping teams off balance. Um, and not only that, she was a great emotional leader. You know, she competed every single day. She showed up every day to work. And our players had a lot of confidence in her as one of the go-to players. All right, when you take a look at next year, I mean, do you, you get, I'm sure you're going to be one of the favorites to get to the Final Four. Uh, what are you going to work on this spring to make sure you have a chance to repeat? Well, we've got to find who's going to replace Shadir. That's a big piece. You okay. know, we're, we're a little thin in some positions, and uh, you know, we'll go back to the drawing board and kind of figure that out. And, and we'll experiment a lot in the spring in some of our matches and, and find that out. And we're going over to Europe as well, so it'll give us a chance to play against some international level teams and, and get some experience. But uh, there's a lot of good teams out there. Penn State returns everybody. Uh, Stanford returns everybody. It's going to be very challenging. And, you know, when you win, it's a different team. And people want a bigger piece of the pie. And how to manage this group is going to be important. Coach, you're always a class act. And uh, thanks for bringing Miss Natty. And she's really pretty. She's, she's <laughs> sparkly you. and shiny. We like her. <laughs> we'll talk to you later. Thanks, <laughs> Thank Coach. You.